Viewer discretion is advised. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Grid 3. Today, I'm going to do a little bit of racing in Grid 3, and today we are also in Monte Carlo doing a little bit of rally racing. Uh, the reason why I decided to jump in and play Dirt 3, which is a fairly old game, um, I'll get into that in a little bit, but here we are. So we're in a single race. We're not doing any campaign or anything, just a single race rally mode in Monte Carlo at Sospel. I don't really know. Vehicle setup is just that. I don't, I didn't do that. That's just there, I guess. Is there a preset for like anything? No, nope. okay. Uh, we are on a custom difficulty setting. So I'm on five out of six of difficulty, full damage, and all the assists off. Uh, the reason why I'm not doing six out of six is I found that the AI at one more up, five is like you can make a couple little mistakes and still have a chance to win. Uh, with six, you can run a perfect rally, like a perfect stage, and just not win at all or get anywhere close so we're just gonna do five so i have somewhat of a chance of winning but yeah no assist so that'll be a little bit difficult i am on the pc and i am using a 360 controller that has been blinking telling me it's low on batteries for about uh over a day now so hopefully we don't run out hopefully it doesn't just cut out on us like it's literally constantly blinking so that's not good so we're gonna go ahead and jump into the race uh, I do apologize now if I sound a little nasally, a little snuffly, stuffily, muffly, I don't know, but uh, I'm a little bit uh, allergies, you know, so. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start the round. Hopefully I can integrate the, uh, the replay cam like I could in Assetto Course and other games. Woo! Corner snuck up on us. So yeah, I have nothing on either. No HUD, no nothing. Um, just 100%. Oh, that's not good. So I really, I kind of have to listen to this guy, which is unfortunate because I'm a loud ass talker and I can't hear what he's saying. But he is telling me what corners are coming up. So that sucks. I can't really hear him. But uh, yeah, hopefully I'll have the replay cam in the corner for you guys. I know a lot of you like that. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of editing just because they put letter block, letter blocks, letter box on the on the replay. So these black boxes on the top and right. And that's terrible corner. What I'm doing here. So hopefully I can crop it and make it work. If you don't see it, then uh, it didn't work. So uh, I do apologize. But uh, I'm gonna try my best to get it working. So yeah, um, the reason why I decided to jump in and play Dirt 3, I know Dirt 3 was probably extremely random, probably just out of nowhere, Dirt 3. Uh, the reason why I decided to jump in and play Dirt 3 was the simple fact of, um, I've been watching, if you guys are subscribed to the Drive channel, um, there is a series that they have on there, which I'm, I don't know if they've done Season 1 on there, or if they did it on their Drive Plus, which is their paid YouTube, but... Um, that's a tight course. Ooh, that's not good. This, that's going to cost us. Let's see if we can try to catch back up to this guy that we were catching up to. But, uh, so yeah, I've been watching Drive, and they put out this series called Launch Control, which is all about rally racing and whatnot, and Team Subaru and everything, and... Oh, man, did it want me to play, like, one of the Dirts. And I've been a huge Dirt fan. I mean, I'm a huge, just like, uh... Wow, that was a really short rally. And we got third. Yeah, that, that spun out really did not... Did not help us by any bit. We got third by like six seconds. Wow, that's really not good. So we're going to do another Monte Carlo stage here and uh, see if we can kind of redeem ourselves a little bit. Uh, I will probably skip through these loading screens just because it's me setting up the thing. So we'll be back in just a second. All right, we are back. So we're doing another course here. I can't remember what the name of it is, but it's at night. I thought that would be kind of cool. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, I'm choking. Uh, to do a little night course. Um, so yeah, like I was saying, I've been watching the Drive channel, and they do this series called Launch Control, which is all about rally racing and Team Subaru and all that stuff, and uh, I'm not going to... Route Del Angles, Angus, I have no idea, Angus Beef Steak, I don't know. But, um, so it's a really, really nice series, and man, did it want me to play... I mean, I was like, oh, I gotta do some rally racing. And, uh, you know, when I want to do rally racing, I go to... Uh, I go to... Oh, you know what? Oh. I just realized something. I did this wrong. I You're not going to see a replay for the first one. Sorry. Whoops. I have to get the replay after. It's not... Dang, that sucks. 
Well, I'll remember to get the replay on this one. I have to, once the race is complete... Ooh, we're going to hit that. Yep. Once the race is complete, I have to watch the replay then. And I kind of just continued because I was talking and being distracted. So I didn't grab the replay. So I do apologize. Replay hopefully will be on this one. Like I said, if, if I can work it out, it'll be there. Ooh, that needs that was a heartbreaking and a terrible entry. But yeah, so I, uh, I've been watching this series, and it's just been... The filmography in it is amazing. It is so good. They're only 15 minutes, which is good because it's not too long. It's not too short. It's just a good amount of time. And uh, the filmography in it is just unbelievable. I mean, it's such an amazing series. Um, and it really wanted to make me do some sort of rally driving. And the only thing I can think of was grid. I'm sorry. <laughs> was dirt. Grid. Yeah. Well, I, th I was thinking... Uh-oh, we're so dead. Into a tree. Dead. Yeah, we're not... Yeah, I need to focus. Sorry, but I gotta do something, dude. I gotta freaking, you know... I gotta commentate here. And that definitely... That really... Oh, my God. I was doing so much better when I was like, hmm, let me play this game first to see if it'll be entertaining to record. And dead on the roof. Uh, Didn't need the glass. Yeah, I know. We're not doing good. But, um... Oh, that was the finish. So, I need to grab this uh, eighth. Yeah, that was freaking terrible. I'm going to grab the replay real quick, and then uh, we'll uh, we'll jump back into doing some more rally. Alrighty, so we have moved on. We are now in Kenya doing a little bit of rally, and uh, I need to hiccup real quick. Alright, sorry. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, we're doing a little bit of rally in Kenya. Decided to change it up from Monte Carlo, going from the cold to the hot. And we're changing up vehicles, too. I'm in an Audi Quattro. Uh, same everything, uh, you know, difficulty and assists and whatnot. Hopefully this race will be a little bit longer. When I was doing practice, I was getting, like, seven-minute rallies, but now I'm getting, like, very, very short courses. So uh, it is what it is, though. So let's see how this goes. All righty. Here we go. So, yeah, um, as I was saying... I've uh, been watching the, the launch control series on Drive, and man, it's it was just it's been so good, like such a great series. I highly recommend watching it. Um, so I've been watching that, and I went, hmm, I gotta do some rally racing. And I, the only thing that popped into mind was uh, Dirt, the Dirt series. And I'm a huge Codemaster fan. Uh, Codemasters is right up there with Rockstar for me. Uh, I'm a huge fanboy of Codemasters. I'm a, I, they, to me, they can do no wrong. They've done great by Dirt and by the Grid series, and just they've made just constantly great games. And for Dirt 3, how old Dirt 3 is, it's held up pretty well. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm, yeah, sure, the graphics are a little bit, eh, it's, it's, you know, it's good, but it's not anything great. I mean, it's not mind-blowing. Um, they're, they're not bad at all, though. But you have to think about the age of this game, and, I mean, it's, it's, pretty good it's pretty good for what it is and i'm still really enjoying it the physics are really nice um i'm really enjoying it i'm glad i picked it up i got it on a steam summer sale i think i got grid grid why do i keep calling it grid i got dirt two three and uh showdown and this is this is actually dirt three the complete edition which i think is all the dlcs oh whoops there we go there's the first controller disconnect like I said, this thing's been blinking, and I don't have any batteries to replace it with. Because I'm still using a 360 controller on the PC. Uh, terrible corner. But yeah, so, um... Yeah, I got that. And this is... So this is actually the complete series with, I believe, all the DLCs, so... That's why I think we, I think Monte Carlo was a DLC. I remember... I think I remember buying it on the 360 a long, long time ago. When I really, really play Dirt 3 a lot. I've always loved the Dirt series. The, the first Dirt has to be one of my favorite games. Like, the very first Dirt has to be one of my... Like, the rally racing is so much... In my opinion, the rally is better than this. The rally in the first Dirt is so good. It's unbelievable. And I really wish I could get my hands on a copy of the, the original Dirt and be able to play it. But it's... I mean, it's... I mean, you can get your hands on a copy of it. It's just... Yeah. I think I kind of want to just leave it in my memory being amazing and not bring it up and have it not be as good as I remember. But since so we're going to finish this rally, what do we get? Mm, first. Hey, there we go. We're not terrible. 
So you see, see what I mean? I kind of ran a pretty clean rally and I won by two seconds. So it's not like I'm destroying the AI, but if I do mess up, I might have a little bit of chance of coming back. But if I run a really good rally, I'll be able to win. So I think five is a very good difficulty setting. So I'm going to grab the replay real quick and uh, we'll probably do another rally or two because it hasn't been that long. Alrighty, so we're in Michigan now, in the rain, changing it up. We're doing a lot of different places. Kind of want to give you guys a wide variety of different tracks. It's all rally racing. Uh, I think I'm going to do another episode right after this, so there should be another episode tomorrow that's probably just going to be rally cross, which will be a lot of fun, a lot of kind of the same cars and everything just against other people. So we're in a Toyota Celica. We're in the 90s cars. So we're going to see how this goes. Castrol. Lots of sponsorships that I don't get anything for. And not that I've ever gotten a sponsorship ever, but, you know. <laughs> Free advertising. All right. Man, this is a very small windshield. Oops. Wow, that was some... From all this rain. That no uh, no, no traction control or anything. But yeah, I've, I've, I really like this game. I really do. I, I know Zach has Dirt 3. I don't know if Jeff does. I would kind of like to do multiplayer, to be honest. I think it would be a lot of fun. The Dirt series I've always really enjoyed, and I really hope they make another one. Um, if they do, I'll definitely buy it. I'm all about Codemasters and the Dirt series. And the, the Grid series is really good, too. I like Grid, too. Um, but enough talking about the game. Let's... But right, while well, we're doing that right now, we're actually doing pretty good. This window is very small. Ooh, ho -ho. I was losing it, but I was losing it in the right direction, which was really good. We're not gonna. Mm, I think we hit one of those. Hard to tell. I think this is this gonna be all asphalt. I don't know. All right, we got right two coming up, so it's gonna be handbrake corner, and that was way too much. And I, don't, <laughs> and I don't think we're going to be able to... Ah, there we go. So we're on some dirt, but I don't think we're going to be able to pull off the first after that spin out like that. Ooh, way too far, way too far. Ooh. So I need to play the uh, I need to play the single player a little bit so I can actually progress in the uh, and like unlock things. Because right now I don't have anything unlocked. I literally just installed the game. I've owned it for a long time. I just had it installed on my old computer played it a little bit and just didn't really play it ever since and just it kind of just sat there but oh way too much of a corner man locked those brakes up and just couldn't turn yeah we definitely are not going to pull off a first place first place finish Let's see if we can get anything on the top five because I believe there's only eight places when I place eighth that was actually last so that's not good. We don't want eight. Anything top five at this point, I think, would be uh, whoa, ho, ho, turning the wrong direction. Ah, we're going to die. Yeah, I'm terrible. Oh, fences. Sorry. God, it's, it sucks because I can't hear him because I'm talking. And, like, he was fine when I was just playing the game earlier. But now that he's... Now that I'm talking, it's hard to hear what he's saying. Which sucks, because then I don't know which way to turn, or what gear to be in, or how, you know, what's coming next, which really sucks. But yeah, no, I'd love to play this game multiplayer. I think it'd be a lot of fun, like me and Jeff, or me, Jeff, and Zach. I don't think me and Zach, and it's nothing against Zach, it's not a diss or anything, but, you know, Zach, well, it is off-road. Maybe Zach might actually be good at it, but Zach is just, when it comes down to actual physical racing, Zach isn't, like, the best I think me and Jeff are very good uh, skill-wise, so I think I'm going to sneeze also in a second. Oh, I really don't want to sneeze. No. No. I got to... <laughs> oh, God. I saw the finish line in my eyes. Seventh. Oh, my God. I'm going to do it again. <laughs> I hate allergies. I freaking hate allergies so much. Ah. Uh. All right, we're going to do one more uh, rally real quick. All righty, we are back in Norway this time uh, in the snow. And we've changed up vehicles once more in something very strange, which is uh, the 60s class, which you'll see here in a minute when I'm driving. And there she is. Mini Cooper. <laughs> 
not going to be good. Uh, we'll see. We'll finish it off with this. This will be the last rally. Uh, we'll see how it goes, though. I'm um, going to try to pull it off with a first place finish. Uh, that'll be a great way to finish off this episode, but I highly doubt that's going to happen. Oh, look at this. Mini Cooper in the snow. Not going to happen. Let's do it. All right. I can't see anything. So, like, where the road is compared to not... Whoa! Whoa! All right, this thing handles a lot differently. It's very slow. Very front-wheel drive. I mean, like, look at the... Wow. Torque steer for days. Oh, come on. You got it. There you go. Woo. All right. Okay, we got a crest and jump. Yeah, we're just going to try that. We're going to try to pull off a dub. Oh, nope. Get all right, Jesus! This is nuts. I can't see the track. I can barely see the track. Did he? Oh my God! This thing does not want to turn. It's just it's just understeer and just torque steer. It's just it's not. It's not good. Not good. I didn't think it was gonna be good, but uh, you know, part of the it's part of the challenge. Driving up old school. Where am I going? Uh oh. Mm, held it. I thought we were gonna crash. Ah, this game is just so good. I really love this game. I'm gonna play it more often when I'm not recording, when I'm just relaxing. I've been trying to find more games to play. One on my channel. But if you have any recommendations, uh, let me know. And two, I've been trying to find more games to just kind of play when I'm not recording. And this is definitely gonna be one of them. Once I finish the GTA 5 PC storyline. Oh, this thing is awesome, but it's like not at the same time. It's awesomely terrible. We're gonna make it. There we go. Over bridge. Where's the bridge? Uh, did we cross a bridge? Because I didn't see one. Oh. All right. Oh, shoot. Yeah, the one thing about not having a HUD, you have no idea if you're a HUD. Why did I say it like that? Uh, oh, God. If you're, you don't know, like, where you are, if your pace is good, if you're slow. Uh, what? I mean, it's good because you don't have the mini-map, I guess. That's the best thing. But if you guys want to see the HUD on, like, regard, like tell me, what, 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 what do you want to see split times? you want to see, like, the mini-map? you want to see, like, whatever I can put on there? I'm not really sure. But if you want to see stuff, let me know. I'm, I'm more than willing. I just, I would prefer it off. Just for the realism. But if you guys want to see it, definitely let me know. Uh, just to let you know, though, and let me know if you want to keep seeing the replay cam, because it's it's up to you guys, really. If you don't want to see the replay cam, it's less work for me, but if you do, then I'll continue. But it will cover up something on the HUD, so. Fifth, that was not good. That was not a first place finish, what I wanted to finish off this episode, but it is what it is. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, something different. Just kind of wanted to do something weird. I don't know. Just throwing out uh, random games. So definitely let me know if you guys want me to play this more. And uh, if you really want me to kind of push either. I know I know 100% Zach owned this game. Uh, own, own this game. Owns this game. And I, I don't think Jeff does. But we might be able to talk him into it. Let me know if you guys really want me to persuade them to play this with me. And uh, we can do some multiplayer. I would, I would like it. Uh, but if you guys want it, then I'll push for it a little bit more. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And remember, if you like this video, if you want to see more, definitely hit the like button. Let me know. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow in uh, Rallycross. We're going to do one more episode of this before uh, we kind of debate whether it's going to stay or not. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and uh, see you next time. Bye.